Hey guys, um, I am going to be making a couple videos today. This first video that I'm making right now, I am going to be doing just a little haul. Um, I went to one estate sale, a couple of estate sales today. I also went to a flea market and Michael's. I also went to Michael's. So I'm just going to show you guys what I got. The first uh, estate sale that we went to today, I really wasn't expecting to find anything today, and I'm not a good haggler either, so I really wasn't expecting to be paying a good price for anything either, but today I found this, it was this box, I'm not exactly sure what, it's a shawl with a pattern, I guess, but the pattern's not in here. All that's in here is three things of pink yarn. And I'm going to be working on some baby, you know, baby booties, baby blankets, just stuff to sell, either on Etsy or at a craft fair. So I got three things of pink yarn for a um, dollar. A dollar. It was a dollar twenty-five, but I got a dollar for it. And I also got this tin box. It's the reflection. This tin box, there's just some like hand painted looking kind of uh, prints on them. I think it's a cookie box. Like cookies originally came in it, but I've been looking for just little um, mismatched boxes to store some of my craft supplies in. So, and I'm not a good haggler at all. I got them. It was two twenty five and I offered two dollars and they took it, so I got a dollar out of that. <laughs> we went also on our way to the second estate sale. We stopped at a flea market and I again wasn't really expecting to find anything, but we found a box of yarn and I was really excited because I've been running low on my yarn supply. So, and I really was not looking forward to spending a lot of money on yarn, and the um, the yarn I got should have costed like $25. If I went to Hobby Lobby or Michaels or something and bought yarn, it would have costed me about $30 for as much yarn as I got. But I only paid $5. He was offering a dollar a piece, and I got 10 rolls. So it's probably, so it would have cost me $10, but I offered him 5 and he took it. My heart was pounding out of my chest. I'm not a good haggler, but I haggle these people, and I'm proud. Like, I really got a good deal for the uh, for the yarn. I got three rolls of this color. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to make with it, but, I mean, you really cannot beat that. This roll in the store would have cost me $3, and I got all of this for 5 So I got three rolls of that color. Here's the other one. I got these two. These are the same color. It's Wool Blend from R Lane. It is 20% wool, 80% acrylic. But it's like a um, a purplish, like a light purple. But I thought it'd be good. Like I said, I'm going to be um, doing some baby items. I know a lot of people who are having babies. And I figured it'd sell good, too, if I made some baby blankets and baby booties and hats and gloves and stuff like that. I got this one. This one's a more of a uh, purplish. The webcam, it's kind of like a bluish purplish, but it's, it's, I mean, it's purple. I got two things of this yarn. I really like it. It's really soft. It's Jiffy. Lion brand Jiffy. Um, 100% Monsanto acrylic. I don't see the color. There's a color number, but I don't see what color it is. 
It's like a pink and a purple and maybe a little bit of blue in there. It's kind of like a multicolored thing of yarn. It's really fuzzy. I also got some brown yarn. I've been running low. I actually just bought some brown yarn, but you can't have too much. I mean, it's fall, so you really can't have too much brown yarn and white. I was needing some white, too. So I got all of that for $5. And from Michael's, I got this thing of yarn. The name, the color on it is gold. It's a gold mustard looking color. See the color? It's like a, um, I really like this color. It's a good fall color. And I just wanted to show some things that I've uh, recently made. This hat I made for someone I met on YouTube, um, Zach. I'm not sure what his YouTube name is, but his name is Zach. And this is, it looks blue on the webcam, but it is really purple. It's like a black and purple striped hat. It's really kind of cool. I think I want to make myself one. It's really cool. But I did that one. And then I also made this child size hat. This one is purple and blue. I'm actually right now making a blanket, a baby blanket with these colors. I just made this hat. The other day, I started with a pattern, and I just kind of started going off on my own. And I really like the way it turned out. I mean, I just finished this. My strings aren't even... That one. I made this hat. And then I also made this hat. None of the strings have been um, woven in yet. Like I literally just finished these within the last couple of weeks. I also made this hat. All of these hats are being sold except for the purple and black one. That one already has an owner, but all these ones that I've shown you I'm going to be selling. I thought this, I picked this up and I really liked it. It's like a, uh, a tan, like a tan beige-ish yarn with black and brown and gray, like, bits throughout it. You can see it. I really like it. I also made this rolled up scarf. I like the, <laughs> I like the way it looks rolled up. But you unroll it. And it's like a little, like a little scarf. It's really kind of short. I think I'm going to make one that's like a little bit longer. But that's what it looks like. And then it just rolls on it. This one is going to be sold also. This one, I just put two yarns together and made it. And then this scarf, I'm not finished with this one yet. This is going to be like an infinity kind of scarf. I am, I'm going to put the button on it. Alright, I'm not sure. But there's going to be a button on it. Like right here. And it's just a, uh, like this, scarf or neck wrap or neck warmer or whatever you want to call it and that's all I have made and that's my haul um, estate sales and thrift stores and flea markets they are awesome places to go I don't like spending a lot of money and today I went out with seventeen dollars and I still have seven dollars so I spent ten dollars today 
and got all of that yarn and the tin box. I am very happy, very happy with my uh, spinnings today.